This crime unfolded in the very place a child should be protected on a school bus. Tonight, the little girl's mother, an Eyewitness News exclusive, breaks her silence, saying this district owes this community an explanation. Talk to their kids, make sure nothing's happened to their babies. This mother still wants answers from the Magnolia Independent School District as a sexual predator heads to prison. It's been really hard. Um, it's, it's been a battle. Matthew Curry pled guilty to assaulting her four-year-old daughter and recording the act while employed as a bus monitor. Um, I didn't understand how it could happen um, on a school bus of all places. Over the course of two months, it happened. So there were several occasions where it was happening on that school bus. A judge sentenced the 41-year-old to a lifetime behind bars yesterday. There are people who trade, possess, and create child pornography and who hurt children in Montgomery County will be dealt with accordingly. When you're put in a position of trust, um, we expect you to hold a high standard and to take care of our most vulnerable population, especially with children, but then the heightened level here was it was special needs children. The little girl's mom is relieved with Curry's sentence. She and her attorney say the school district needs to be more transparent. There's no denying that it happened, and an explanation is due as to how it happened and what they knew, if anything, uh, or what they should have known. Magnolia ISD refuses to answer specific questions about the egregious crime. Earlier this year in a written statement, they told us our top priority is the safety and well-being of all students and any deviation from this expectation will not be tolerated. Eight months later, there's no clarity. The district initially said today we do not have any additional comments before telling us this afternoon they believe justice has been served. This is not over. Magnolia ISD needs to they need to do an investigation into what happened on that bus. They owe it to my daughter. They owe it to, they owe it to all the children from my, with Magnolia ISD. In Magnolia, Steve Campion, 13 Eyewitness News.